and the art that pretty much made me the artist I am today. We have our podcast coming out very soon as I wait for the mic to come, I believe on Saturday. Do you guys want to see what's going to be in the background? So we're going to see a bunch of comic books, manga, independent works, etc. So let's do it. All right. This is the setup, by the way. Thank you to my wife who set this up like beautifully, like, oh my God. So anyway, some of these books I haven't seen even in a while myself, so I'm very excited to go through this. We've got Walking Dead, a bunch of Image stuff because I love Image. Uh, it's probably the only publisher I would work with. Uh, a Dragon Ball, a visual history. This book is awesome. I literally just got it like about a week ago. So it looks sick and everything. I love that. If anybody knows anything about me, Dragon Ball is one of the reasons I'm an artist today. Uh, as well as Spider-Man, Todd McFarlane's Spider-Man, and Jim Lee's X-Men. But yeah, we've also got, uh, what's it called, Master Kim Jong-Gi, two of his, his books, uh, Rest in Peace to Goat. These are very steep, so if you get your hands on these, they're awesome. The greatest artist ever, in my opinion. Um, these two stay on top because I wouldn't be who I am without these. So um, not, not as much super, but Dragon Ball Z and Dragon Ball. But yeah, this inspired me to make my own comic book in the future, The Unlimited Ink. And I made it with that gentleman, Todd Beats, whose artwork is right here. So uh, I love that near and dear to me. Uh, a cover I did for Ace Blade, gotta support my indie creators out there. So what else we got? A bunch of black and white books. I tried to get good with silhouettes over the years because my book is in black and white. So a bunch of those, uh, Gorilla's awesome. Ketsuya is is incredible. I mean, if you love Master Kim Jong-Gi, you're going to love Katsuya. Um, let's see here. Supporting the homie right here, Hustle. My boy Tyler Davis. Uh, another person following his dreams made his own manga. So I'm I'm very happy uh, to put him on the shelf here. Got a bunch of stuff. Uh, Ty, you got me into Sakamoto days. Got a bunch of One Punch Man. Um, let's see here. Mike Mignola's. Artisan Edition, How to Draw Comics the Marvel Way, Framed Ink, probably one of the most helpful books in, in art history that I can think of, for myself at least. So, uh, oh, I love Sean Murphy's Tokyo Ghost, by the way. Uh, yeah, so much stuff. And then a giant poster of Master Kim Jung-gi. So, yeah, I hope you guys like it. And yeah, this is the logo that I have officially made for the Drawn Out podcast. I hope you guys enjoy. This is clever. I'm pretty happy with this. But yeah, the mic will be in soon. And let me know if you want me to open up any of those books that you saw there. Peace out, guys.